Hello everyone, it's Nick here, MP Gunsmith and Firearms, located in Lewiston, New York, phone number 716-481-7302. I'm just going to do a quick video on a Winchester Model 70 bolt. Uh, they have a known issue where the safety gets stuck, whether it's corroded in there, rusted in there, just gummed up, or you get a divot along the shaft of the firing pin that actually prevents it from moving. Uh, there's videos out there to show you how to field strip these bolts, but none of them show you how to get it out of that fire position so you can field strip it because um, you can't take it apart when it's in the fire position. The firing spring will prevent it from coming apart. I'm going to show you what I mean. This one is stuck right here in the firing position. This is a three position safety, so obviously you have the firing position. Uh, the middle position allows you to work the bolt and chamber around but it will not allow you to pull the trigger and the far back position will actually lock the bolt in place so you can't even uh, work the bolt so if this was in the middle position because that's where it needs to be to disassemble it it needs to be in the middle position you would simply push down this detent right here okay and i'm going to show you and then you would spin it apart and you would allow you know it would allow you to unbolt or unscrew that i'm going to do it right here so you push it down and it would allow you to unscrew that and pull out the whole uh, firing pin and the spring. But with it in the firing position, this firing spring actually pulls this forward and prevents you from unscrewing it. So how do you get that bolt apart? As you can see, as you can see there, there's, there's rust inside there. So that's what I'm thinking happened. It just sat for so long. So to get this apart, put it back into place, lock that detent back in, and you need a vise, soft jaws, um, you're gonna have to bear with me too because they do slide out of these soft jaws pretty easy um, so All right, so as you can see in that video, I locked the bolt into the vise. Uh, this one has a little bit of added. I had to get a little creative with my soft jaws so they would hold on to the, uh, the bolt itself. But now with the safety in the middle position, okay, we can disassemble this bolt. So. You do that by pushing down on your detent, okay, and simply unscrewing the rear of the bolt. It's pretty simple, okay. That comes out, then you have your firing pin, your firing pin spring, and this some of them, the newer versions have like a C, C clamp you'd have to remove, and you can remove the firing uh, pin spring. This one just has a collar, uh, you can see it very well. It's kind of cut out right there so I'm going to push down on the spring rotate this collar quarter turn and I'll be able to remove it all off of there it's just you gotta fight everything that and you got to be very careful it's got a lot of spring pressure in there so firing pin spring there's that collar I was talking about that's probably not on video but you really got pushed down you can see how it's cut out right there okay and you can see the firing pin shaft like that okay so when you take this collar off, so you got to force down past the spring, it fits in there, and it rotates, it locks it in place. Okay, let me do that again on camera. So you can see the shape of the collar, you can see the cutout on the firing pin. So when you go to take it off, put it on, 
yeah, force down that spring till you see those notches there, and then you would rotate it. And then it would come back up, and that's locked into place. When you take it off, force that spring down, rotate it, quarter turn, take it off. So that's the firing pin spring. So now I'm gonna work this safety. I'm probably gonna soak it and see what I can get out of it if it comes off. So that being said, that's it. That's a quick, quick little video on how to get that unstuck or get it apart when your your safety is stuck in the fire position. So hopefully this helps. Um, Sorry, it's a little cut up. My soft jaws didn't want to cooperate after mush them in the vise so many times. It kind of mushrooms up and didn't want to get a grip. I actually had to take my drill bit and drill out part of the soft jaw so it would grip better. So hopefully this helps a little bit. Thanks.